Hey everyone, welcome back to Awesomer Kids. Today we're going to use these Play-Doh balls and turn them into donuts. Let's start by using this light brown Play-Doh. Use this cutter to make a donut hole. And here's an original donut. Before we add decorations, let's make a few more donuts. This time we'll make a yellow donut. Make a donut hole. And here's a lemon flavored donut. Now let's make a donut using this dark brown Play Doh. Follow the same steps as before. And here's a dark chocolate donut. Let's make one more. We'll use this pink Play Doh. Make a donut hole. And here's a strawberry donut. Now let's make a glaze for each donut. Roll out this red Play Doh. And we're going to make a strawberry glaze. Give me one second. Check it out! Here's a sweet strawberry glaze. Let's put this glaze on top of our original donut. And here's an original donut with a strawberry glaze on top. Now let's make a dark chocolate glaze. Use this dark brown Play-Doh. Follow the same steps as before. Awesome! We made a rich dark chocolate glaze. Let's put it on top of the lemon donut. Perfect! Here's a lemon donut with a chocolate glaze. Now let's make a vanilla glaze. Use this white Play-Doh. Give me one second while I make the glaze. And let's put our delicious vanilla glaze on top of this dark chocolate donut. Excellent! Here's a dark chocolate vanilla glazed donut. Let's make one more glaze using this blue Play-Doh. Roll it out. Create the glaze shape. And here's a blueberry glaze. Let's put it on top of the strawberry donut. Check it out. We just made a strawberry donut with a blueberry glaze. Alright, now let's get a little more detailed. Let's add some sweet frosting to this strawberry glazed donut.
This donut looks super yummy now, don't you think? Alright, now let's make another topping using this purple Play-Doh. Use the circle stamp. And here are a bunch of purple colored dots. Let's put it on top of this lemon chocolate glazed donut. This donut looks really pretty. Now let's roll out this orange Play-Doh. And I'll roll out a few more colors too so that we can make some sprinkles. Let's cut thin lines for each color. Give me one second. Now let's chop them up a bit to make the sprinkle shape. Start with yellow. Orange. Blue. And red. Awesome! Let's put these sprinkles on top of this dark chocolate vanilla glazed donut. Oh wow! This donut looks much better with sprinkles. Alright, let's decorate our last donut. Use some yellow Play-Doh, make thin lines. Went ahead and made more, and made some green ones too. Now let's put the lines on top of this strawberry blueberry glazed donut. Give me one second. And check it out! What a colorful donut! Let's take a closer look at each donut again and let us know which one you like the best. Well, I hope you had fun today. If you did, be sure to hit that subscribe button for more awesome videos. See ya! Hey everyone! Welcome back to Awesomer Kids! Since the movie's coming out real soon, today we'll be making an Incredibles 2 themed popsicle. Let's start by rolling out this ball of brown Play-Doh. Alright, now let's make a Play-Doh popsicle shape using this cardboard cutout. Give me one second. And perfect! Here's a chocolate Play-Doh popsicle. Alright, now let's move that to the side and roll out this ball of white Play-Doh.
Okay, and just like we did with the brown play-doh, we're going to make another popsicle shape. Give me one second to make the shape. Awesome! Now we made a vanilla Play-Doh popsicle. Now let's put these two popsicles together. And check it out! We have a chocolate and vanilla Play-Doh popsicle. Okay, leave that to the side now, and let's roll out this ball of red Play-Doh. Next, let's wrap this red Play-Doh around our popsicle. This will only take a minute. Awesome! We just wrapped our chocolate and vanilla popsicle with red strawberry Play-Doh. Okay, now let's make the Incredibles 2 logo. Start by rolling out this ball of black Play-Doh. We need it to be an oval shape. That's pretty good. Now let's put the black Play-Doh right here. Excellent! But we're not finished yet. Now let's roll out this ball of orange Play-Doh. This has to be a larger oval. And let's stack the black oval on top of the orange one. Okay, now I'll be making the eye and the two, so sit back and relax while I do it. Here's the dot for the I, and this will be used for the letter I and the number 2. Awesome! Now let's put everything together. Clean it up a bit. Add the finishing touches. Okay, now let's insert the popsicle stick. And check it out! Here's our Incredibles 2 popsicle. What do you think? Let's add a bite mark. And it looks like someone took a big bite out of our delicious looking popsicle. Is everyone going to go watch the movie when it comes out? I can't wait! Well, I hope you had fun today. If you did, be sure to hit that subscribe button for more awesome videos. See ya! Hey everyone, welcome back to Awesome for Kids! Today we're going to be making a Play-Doh Rainbow Rose Cake. 
Are you ready? Awesome! Let's start by making the cake base. Here's a ball of brown Play-Doh. Let's roll it out. Now let's use this circle cutter. Perfect! Now give me one second while I do the same thing with the rest of these Play-Doh balls. Awesome! Now let's stack the circles on top of each other. It'll go large to small, and then we'll have to shape it a bit. Okay, now let's roll this around a bit. Perfect! Our base is ready, so let's make our rainbow rose petals. Let's start by rolling out this ball of red Play-Doh. Okay, now let's use a small circle cutter to make multiple circles. Perfect! We made six red circles. Now let's cut one side for each circle. And we're finished. Now let's do the same thing with this orange Play-Doh. Roll it out. Make circles. Awesome! We made seven orange circles. Now let's use this yellow Play-Doh. Perfect! We made seven yellow circles too. Now let's work with this green Play-Doh. Nice! We made five green circles. Alright, time to work with this blue Play-Doh. Perfect! We made four blue circles. And last but not least, let's work with this purple Play-Doh. Excellent! We made three purple circles. Okay, now just sit back and relax while I make a beautiful rainbow rose. Start with red. Now orange. Now yellow. Now green.
Let's use blue. And purple. Perfect! Here's how our Play-Doh Rainbow Rose Cake turned out. This looks really pretty, don't you think? Anyone want a slice? Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to click that subscribe button for more awesome videos. See ya! Hey everyone, welcome back to Awesomer Kids. Today we're going to do another Play-Doh food video. Let's make a giant Monster High themed popsicle. To begin, we're going to need some brown Play-Doh. Roll it out. Now let's cut out the Monster High logo shape. Perfect! Now let's roll out some white Play-Doh. Cut out the same shape as before. Awesome! Now let's stack the brown shape on top of the white. Make sure it's all lined up and let's move on to our next step. Now let's roll out some pink Play-Doh. Cut this part out. And give me one second while I wrap half of the logo shape with this pink Play-Doh. There we go! Next step, let's roll out some blue Play-Doh this time. And we're pretty much going to be doing the same thing by wrapping the other half of the logo with blue Play-Doh. This looks pretty cool already, don't you think? Now let's roll out some black Play-Doh to create some more designs. Cut the black Play-Doh into thin pieces. And this pink side has black diagonal lines. Let's clean this up a bit.
perfect! It's looking more like the Monster High logo now. Alright, next step, roll out some white Play-Doh. The logo has a gold Z, so we'll be making that now. Cut out the shape. Now that we got the goal's head shape, let's add some more details. Here are the eyes, and this is the nose. Fill it all in with black Play-Doh. Excellent! Touch it up a bit. Add the black eyelashes. Now let's roll out some pink play-doh to make the bow. We're going to need two heart shapes. And a tiny piece of pink play-doh rolled up in a ball. Alright, let's put this bow together. Make it on top of this black play-doh so that we can make a black outline as well. Cut it out. That is one good looking bow. Let's put it on our goal. And check it out. It looks pretty close to the ghoul on the Monster High logo. Let's attach this onto the middle of the popsicle. Hmm. Wait one second. Let me fix something. Those black diagonal lines were in the way. There we go. And here's our Monster High Popsicle. Now the final step is to insert the Popsicle stick. And we're finished. I gotta say, this turned out pretty well. Now let's add one more detail by adding a bite mark. There's a strawberry and blueberry glaze on the outside of the popsicle, and inside is filled with chocolate and vanilla. It's a pretty popsicle with amazing flavors. Well, I hope you had fun today. If you did, be sure to hit that subscribe button for more awesome videos. See ya!